hello lovelies welcome back to my channel is your girl Unyo Gadima here i'm back with another youtube coaching video in today's video i'll be showing you guys how to make a custom thumbnail that is clickable that drives view so if this is what you would like to watch please stick around to the end of this video please don't forget to join my family like the video share the video and if it helps you in any way without further ado let's dive into the topic of today <music> we already know what a thumbnail is any youtuber both beginner upcoming be everybody we know what a thumbnail is a thumbnail is basically a visual icon that depicts or shows what a video is all about which means i can actually know what your video is talking about through your thumbnail so the first step to making every or any thumbnail is being intentional about it you have to be intentional about your thumbnail what do i mean by being intentional you don't just pick from the pictures that YouTube select from your videos. We are content creators. Anytime you upload video on YouTube and it gets the time to put custom thumbnail, there's always a picture that YouTube selects for us from our videos and, and as something that should form or represent a thumbnail for us. But you have to be intentional because if you're intentional about your thumbnail, you will take action shots. You will take shots that shows the expression of what your thumbnail is all about. You understand? So if you are not intentional about your thumbnail, you can you end up having the wrong expression for the right video. You, if you understand what I mean. So please, you have to be intentional about your thumbnail. After being intentional about your thumbnail, the next thing you do is to research on the particular topic that is looking for topic that falls in the same range with that particular topic like looking for thumbnail that falls in the same range with a particular topic so if you're making a video on how to drive a car you sh if when you go on youtube you will search for how to drive a car and you will take the consistent um consistent um, items or icons that 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 appears consistently in the different video i'm not saying you should go and copy someone's work you don't copy someone's work so you do you do you're not copyrighted in any way but in every 10 thumbnail there's something that looks alike there's something that that seems similar there's something that looks the same those are the kind of things you pick out you pick out the things that is consistent in every 10 thumbnail like if you see if you open the first page of youtube and you see five thumbnails if you see the youtube icon in those five thumbnails then you know that this thing is actually consistent it's something that almost everybody puts in in that particular thumbnail that is pertaining to the topic you're talking about so research on the topic look for the one that works for you make sure that it's something that other people have actually clicked on in some other person's thumbnail if you get what i mean after researching you take action shots if your video is all about um answering questions you don't take you don't take a um, shot that is about cooking if your video is about um I would like to if, if if your video is about maybe having a surprise package you have to put that surprise um picture like i'm surprised and if you're if something if it's a, a, an announcement you put the happy face and all those things you have to take action shots that expresses the particular video you're talking about the tone of the video and what the video is all about so if you're trying to tell people don't buy this fake phone you have to display the phone and show them how disappointed you feel about the seller so those are the kind of things we're talking about you take action shots and you take photos that expresses the tune of that particular video next thing you do is to show your brand everybody we as youtuber we we came onto this platform to show our personality show what we are known for every channel has his or her color or what the person always puts you everybody but has their own personality so show your brand and when you choose your brand make sure you're consistent with it if you if you if you make a video using a kind of style make sure you use the same style in your next video be continue to be consistent with it so that people will know that this is what you are actually known for me i use popping board most of the time for my thumbnails i use popping board i use oswald i use um this um new acrylic something like that i'm going to leave it in the screen and i use this Mont montserrat something like that i'm going to leave it in the screen so that the particular the, the whole set i make use of each and every one of them so those are the fonts that i use for most of my thumbnail so 
everybody should get a brand get a brand like get a brand have your personality you cannot be like every other person so guys i know i must i must have said a lot and shown a lot so without further ado i'm going to show you how i make my own thumbnail the images i use the font i use and all those good stuff so let's dive into the video <laughs> 